It appears to have fur, whiskers, and teeth. Its blood-red surface is tough and warty, and it reeks of death. Don't get your imagination too high, it's not an animal. Meet Rafflesia, often referred to as the corpse flower. It's also known as the stinking corpse lily because of its powerful scent, rotting meat. But why has it picked this pungent smell? This botanical giant not only tips the scales at an astounding 15 pounds, but also boasts a scent that's as unique as it is unconventional. Buckle up because this is the extraordinary story of Rafflesia. Now, don't let the name alarm you. It's not because it smells like a rotting corpse, but because of its massive size and the distinctive scent it emits. So, what makes Rafflesia so special? Well, let's start with its jaw-dropping size. This holds the title for the world's largest individual flower, with some species reaching an astonishing three feet in diameter. Now, Rafflesia is not your typical flower. It's a parasite, lacking leaves, stems, or roots like most plants. Instead, it relies on a specific host vine for its nutrients. This unique lifestyle adds to the intrigue surrounding the Rafflesia. The life cycle of Rafflesia is nothing short of a botanical marvel. It begins as a tiny, inconspicuous bud on the host vine, remaining hidden for months. Then, when it's ready to bloom, it transforms into this colossal flower, attracting all sorts of attention from insects and curious onlookers. And speaking of attention, let's talk about that smell. The Rafflesia emits a pungent odor that's often likened to the stench of a decaying animal. But fear not, it's not to repel us, it's a clever strategy to attract specific pollinators, like flies, who are drawn to the scent of rotting flesh. Nature has its ways, doesn't it? These unsuspecting flies become essential partners in Rafflesia's reproductive journey, ensuring the continuation of this extraordinary species. There are at least 13 species of Rafflesia, but two of them have already been unsighted since the Second World War and are presumed extinct, and the record-holding Rafflesia arnoldii is facing extinction. To make matters worse, no one has ever cultivated Rafflesia in a garden or laboratory. The Rafflesia serves as a testament to the incredible biodiversity found in our rainforests. However, many Rafflesia species are endangered due to habitat loss and illegal harvesting. Conservation efforts are crucial to preserving these magnificent plants and the ecosystems they call home. That's it for today guys. And don't forget to like and share this video and subscribe to our channel for more such videos.